It's not easy being me we'll Wash your face and brush your hair we'll Nag, 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 it's just not fair I'm horrid Henry So tell me school, I'm gonna rule And when I'm king, I'll do my thing And then my life will be so sweet I'm horrid Henry Na, 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 na The purple hand gang rules, okay well, It's so easy being me I'm horrid Henry Dance, Fluffy. Who want to join us? Mr. Film Star. I've restocked the loo rolls, cleaned up my toothbrush holder, dusted under the bars, and now I'm going to clean my shoes. Oh, that's a good boy, Peter. What a worm. <laughs> <laughs> Henry, go, go away, away, worm. worm. <laughs> 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 Is rude, Ralph. That's gross, Fluffy. Yeah, gross, Fluffy. <laughs> You're not meant to do that. She's not the only one. What do you mean? You're not meant to be holding hands with a ghoul, Henry. Huh? You can let go of my hand now, Henry. See, Henry, what I don't understand. What is it, Al? What is it that you don't understand? Well, why you were holding hands with a bogey brain girl in the first place, Henry? No! <laughs> you see, me and the gang. You and the gang? Yeah, the Purple Hand Gang. Remember us? I remember you. Yeah, of course you do. You just don't remember how come you were holding hands with a bogey brain girl in the movie. No, I mean, yes. I mean, there was a reason why. Was there? I didn't see any reason in the movie. It's not there. It didn't make it into the final version of the movie. Oh, I get it. You had the movie censored because you didn't want us to know that you'd been holding hands with a bogey brain girl. Well, that doesn't work, does it? If I didn't want you to know about it, then I'd have cut it all out, wouldn't I? Including the bit where I was holding her hand. Yeah, I suppose you would, Henry. So, what happened then, Henry? Look, if I tell you, do you promise never to tell anyone else? Of course. What are friends for? Cos only two people know what really happened in Our Lady Gideon to school. And that's Margaret and me. I understand, Henry. What happens in Gideantus stays in Gideantus, hey, Henry? Yeah, well, I guess you could say that. Picture the scene. Me and Margaret walk through that big creaky door. And we walk into that great big hall. And all we can hear is whispering. And then Bogey Brain says, run away. So we run. I think I'm going a bit mad because I think I see Miss Battleaxe talking to me out of a picture. Henry, you horrid boy. 
Ooh, that's weird. Too weird. Anyway, I get upstairs and I can't see Margaret anywhere. Margaret? Margaret! So I start to walk along the creepy corridor. And then... What happened then, Henry? And then she grabbed me! Well, yeah, we know that bit. What happened after that? Turned out we were in the headmistress's study. Right, you can let go of me now. Shh, they'll hear you. Where are we anyway? Headmistress's daddy is my guess. Dad'll be here soon to take me home. What about me? What about you? <gasps> hear anything? No. That means they're up to something. How'd you know? They're girls, aren't they? <laughs> Told you. <laughs> what are you looking for? What do you think, Bird Brain? Need ammunition. Yep. Yeah. Otherwise, we're never going to get out of here. If you can't think of anything useful to say, don't say anything. We could use this. And we could use this as ammunition. I said. I heard what you said. Cool. Is that their confiscation cupboard? Shouldn't think so. This is official stuff. It's good stuff too. When the going gets tough, the tough get going. You load, I'll fire. That's not fair. If you think I'm touching that stuff, you've got another thing coming. Go, Giddy Antus! Should be go away, Giddy Antus! <laughs> Miss Battleaxe? And you are? Let me guess. Henry. Horrid Henry. Yes, but you're not. I'm not your Miss Battleaxe, no. But I am Miss Battleaxe. I am Boudicca's twin sister. That's why the picture was there, Henry. What do you mean? The picture when you thought old Battleaxe was talking to you. It was her twin sister. Oh, yeah. Still weird, though. Yeah, still weird, Henry. Anyway, where was I? Yeah, we're going to tell me how you ended up holding hands with a bogey brain girl. Yeah, so anyhow, she said she wasn't going to punish us. Our own Miss Battleaxe would do that. Cool. Well, uh, not cool. No. But anyway, that's not what we were worried about. We needed to find a way to get out. And it seemed like the only way we were going to get out was to dress like girls. <laughs> it's not funny. Yeah, it is. <laughs> and watch out for those girls. They bite. Thanks. I'll go first. Good luck. So, not holding hands yet then, Henry? No. You know what happened next. Can't believe you did that, Henry. Margaret wanted to go back for a fluffy fairy, but it was too dangerous. <laughs> Looks like that's our only way out. If we're quick, we might just make it. Wait. If we give up now, we're dead, Henry. What happened next, Henry? That's when Bogey Brain turned to me and said, Ready, Beetle Breath? And I said, Ready as I'll ever be, Bogey Brain. Oh, that's 
it's really romantical, Henry. Uh, no, it's not. How did it feel, Henry? How did what feel? Holding hands with a bogey brain girl. Mm, like holding hands with a bogey brain girl, I guess. Anyway, now you know what happened. Yep. Uh, now we know what happened. What do you mean, we? You mean you and me, right? Well, you and me and everyone out there. <laughs>